In Taro Adun, I am the Messianic Drew. In the old days, the mighty Protoss stood united. As their prides began to take over, the Protoss fragmented into warring factions. Thus began the Aeon of Strife. As the ancient blood feuds raged on, one mystic known as Kas developed a system that would bring an end to the wars and establish peace and order once more. That system was known as the Kala. The Kala instilled a new sense of unity and hope to the mighty Protoss. Slowly, they began to give up their age-old feuds and rally to the path. The Kala meant to define a rigid system of behavior, also held a dark secret. There were tribes who refused to embrace the Kala, believing that their individual identities would be erased to promote the rule of the Judicator caste. These rogue tribes were not hostile or militant, but they believed that the loss of individualism would be the doom of their race. Fearful that these tribes would undo all that the Kala had accomplished, the rogue tribes were expelled from the Protoss homeworld of Ayur. These tribes were called the Dark Templar. Hunted and feared by their own brethren, the Dark Templar led a solitary existence within their spacefaring vessels. Traveling throughout the cold void of space, they never abandoned their love for Ayur and thus worked to safeguard their long-lost homeworld in any way they secretly could. The tale of the Dark Templar is also the tale of Messianic Jews, a group that for nearly two millennia believed in Yeshua HaMashiach, often in secret, and yet refused to give up their identity as Jews. In Taro Adun, in the service of Yerushalayim.